we're going to start with the tomatoes and um, really probably beef tomatoes, right beef tomatoes are the best. Um, I've just got small tomatoes so I'm just going to use those. And if I just, just chop them in half like that. So there's about four or five, go a couple more probably. There we go, just chop them in half. And I'm also going to use a few sun-dried tomatoes as well, which are really nice in there. You don't have to, but they give it a really nice, really nice rich flavour, which is what you want in tomato sauce, you want a really rich, intense flavour. Uh, next I'm going to use some, um, some lemon, and I'm just going to uh, put a whole slice in. So I'm going to take the outer layer off, take off as much of the pith as I can, but it doesn't matter if I keep the pith on, it won't affect the flavour. There we go. And um, I'm going to use some avocado, and this is to give it some creaminess. There's my lovely avocado, perfect inside this one. So I'll probably use half an avocado. I'm also going to use some salt and pepper. I've got some Himalayan crystal salt, which is really nice stuff. It contains all the minerals. Some, some black pepper there. I've got some other types of pepper as well. And um, I use spices, so I'm going to use a bit of curry powder as well. About about a quarter of a teaspoon. I'm going to use some whole cumin seeds, so just a few of those, and um, a little bit of turmeric with the cumin, quite nice together, a little bit, just like that, I don't, I don't want to put in too much, you can always add in more later. Um, and now I'm just going to uh, blend it. Now I might need a little bit of water. Um, let's just see how we go. But I don't want to add too much water because I want a nice thick tomato sauce. So let's blend it. And of course there's water in the tomatoes. So you really want to put it on like number five, four or five. There we go, five. That looks good, that looks good. Let me try a little bit. Mm. Wow, that's really good. So I'm just going to add in a bit of oregano, or oregano, some people like to call it. Uh, you can put in like your mixed herbs and things like that at this point. Um, some pepper, of course adding garlic and ginger, and chili also if you want to, to increase the flavour. And uh, just going to whiz it up a bit more. Maybe leave it on that setting for a few more seconds. There we are. We're done. So just to uh, show you in my, in my pan, I'm just going to heat it up a little bit. That's what it looks like. Can you see that? There we go. It's nice and thick. It's nice and thick. It's not water or anything. It's much better than what you buy in the store. So I am going to keep this raw. I'm not going to heat it up a lot. I'm just going to warm it up. Alright, thanks for watching guys. See you next time.